Right, hi everyone. Uh, just uh, not too long ago, um, just a couple of hours ago, I went to uh, see a diabetic nurse, and it wasn't good news. I'll show you, I'll show you all this actually on here. Um, if you can see it, if you can see that. Let's see, the writing is what it was with it. And the you can see that uh, uh, most of that's gone up, so it's not good news. I've uh, basically I've got a, a straight on a low fat diet. Definitely, I've had, you know out goes the junk food. Really, must get out goes the junk food because um. You know, last time I seen her, I really should have done it then, more so, I've been you know, had so much on, so many things going on, and all these courses that I've been doing, I've been relying on um, junk food a bit too much, so out goes the pizza, out goes the burgers, chips, all that, and it's got to be a low-fat diet, I've also um, got a, a more fruit and veg and that, more exercise, all that stuff. So uh, it's not great news given uh, that what's on there. Um, basically, I've got um, bad, high bad cholesterol, and it's at uh, eight, eight point eight on there, uh, and it's uh, not good to be honest. So um, yeah, I got a really uh change uh change my lifestyle really um and it's a, a dietary change and see if i can motivate myself to do more exercise i know i'm out and about more i do and you know walking about more and that i've just got to do that a little bit more because um I've got to make those little arrows go down rather than up. In other words, you know, I've got to improve things quite a fair bit. I've got two months, really, um, before I go, got a, uh, uh, they're going to test it again and it's be fasting as well. So, um, yeah, not great news, but I can turn this around for myself. Um, Basically, uh, if I don't, you know, one, I will develop diabetes because um, uh, before the average was 6.5 or something like that, it's gone up to 6.7 now, so it's got a tiny bit worse, uh, but uh, if I can do what I've been asked to do, low fat diet, you know, more fruit and veg and more exercise, one, I'm going to lose the weight. And to I and if I keep to it, keep, uh, all that I shouldn't hopefully uh, develop the diabetes. Um, well, I'm hoping not anyway. Uh, just gotta um, keep to it. I mean, in the long run, I've just got to just eat more healthy. Uh, definitely more healthier than uh, what I have been doing lately. And hopefully some of the things, you know, that, uh, you know, I suffer from at the moment will improve as well. I, uh, one of the things is, because I'm a little bit overweight, uh, um, I over, I, I just think that's weight related partly. I, um, sweat a bit, over sweat a bit, where, uh, I'm pouring off of me one day, really dripping. I mean, it's, it's like Niagara Falls off of me, but, um, Everybody else in the room went so bad, but uh, I seem to sweat worse than uh, others, which ain't great. Um, also, I got pains in the sides there and and there sometimes um, with my colitis as well. Uh, it's not great. It's not good. But hopefully, I can turn things around, and hopefully, you know. I can get much more healthier. It is just time for me to concentrate on my physical health. You know, I've, I've done a lot of work to do with them, um, you know, to, to do with the, um, doing these courses and everything else and trying to set up a shop, but I've really got to concentrate more on my physical health.
and improve things. And um, I had a nice healthy meal earlier. Um, it was a, a fish, um, uh, boiled potatoes, and um, the marifat peas. So um, that's not too bad a, a meal, uh, but I just got to keep with it. Um, got to really look at things and um, uh, change things. Also, what was it that she put on Benacol plant something? Uh, Sterols? Stero uh, I can't read it. I'm not sure what's on there, but uh, yeah, I've got to um, look at that as well. They were on about, um, uh, to control my cholesterol, um, they were on about some sort of tablets, but uh, they said if I get or go on there, they're lifelong. But uh, they said, cause basically, I've got to follow this and just see if I can bring the bad cholesterol down. If I can, I might be able to avoid taking these lifelong tablets, but I'll have to see. And to be honest, also, given that I'm 39 now, and you know, I'm just hit middle age for virtually, um, I just gotta go careful because, um, I'll be a bit more prone to heart attacks and strokes and things, and I really don't want that. Uh, that's it really. Uh, till next time.